guys, it's tea time. Cause my tummy is kind of, it's having, it's having a little party that I don't approve of right now. So I figured that I would make some tea instead, cause that always settles my stomach. I'm having um, the the Good Earth Original Sweet and Spicy Tea. It's like, oh, it's so good. I love it. It's either that tea or green tea. Those are the only teas that I ever drink, and I love them so much. But so having this this morning. Um, I'm talking a little bit lighter than usual because I have a shoot this morning, so it's pretty early. I got up and was like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make some tea and then sneak back in my room and wait until I get the text that says, hey, we're here to pick you up. So, yeah, just, uh, hanging out waiting for that. It's funny, when I was making tea, I was thinking about how often I see specifically British YouTubers do videos about how they make tea. I don't think that, like... Somebody from North America would ever think to do that. Um, I don't know, maybe. Like, I guess I know a lot of people who do tea differently. But we don't drink as much tea here. So you don't really see it as often. You don't see as many, like, differences in how you make tea. Um, I don't know. I just, uh, I boil water. I add it to a tea bag. Or loose leaf in the little, in the little ball. Put it in there. I let it, I cover it with aluminum foil. I let it sit for three minutes and then I drink it. I never add anything to it. I don't like adding like sugar or anything to my tea. Um, I add honey to it when I'm sick. But other than that, I just kind of let it, I let it do its own thing. Um, because typically I'm drinking tea for a very specific reason. I want like a specific flavor out of it. I either want spicy, so I drink this tea, or I want, um, really earthy tasting, so I drink green tea. If you add anything to green tea, it suddenly it suddenly doesn't taste as earthy, you know? I wonder if this is cold enough yet. Mmm. It's so good. If you guys don't have Good Earth Original, or if you've never tried it, see if you can find it and give it a try. It's so delicious. I try to get everybody I know to try this tea. <laughs> it's so tasty. Because people that typically don't like tea because they think it's bland really like this tea. And again, it goes along with um, what I was saying about candles. Um, that I don't like really fruity um, smelling candles. I don't like fruit tasting teas either. No. If I want fruit, I'll drink a smoothie. I don't want, I don't want fruit teas. So, um, yeah, this tastes very like, um, very rustic, I guess. I don't know what else, what other word to use, honestly. But yeah. Tea's good. Um, I, my mom really likes, uh, she likes green tea. She and I drink green tea together all the time when I'm home. Um, there's green tea. She has, she has tea every morning, actually, now that I think about it. I think that's a newer thing, though. I think that's, like, a last couple of years sort of thing. That's not something that she's done forever, but it's cool. She doesn't drink coffee in the morning. Um, my dad does. My dad drinks a lot of coffee, but my mom typically drinks green tea right when she wakes up. Um, and at night she really likes, this is what I was originally going to say, at night she really likes, um, like mango teas, I think? Like mango and peach teas? Text me if that's wrong, mommy. I can't remember. I think it's like mango and peach stuff that you drink a lot, though. My dad hates tea. Don't drink it. <laughs> Um, let's see, who else do I know that drinks tea? Um, Joe just keeps like a big box of just Lipton black tea around. I'm not as big of a fan of that. I don't like black teas in general, typically, though. I think this counts as a black tea, but it doesn't taste like one. Mmm. Ah, oh, it's so good. I used to reuse tea bags. And then my mom read somewhere that it's not good for you. Was it my mom or was it Amanda? That like something in the tea bag um, seeps out. Uh, other than other than what you want to seep out, obviously. But like there's something there's something that's not good for you that starts getting in your tea after you use it more than once. I have no idea. I can't remember. Something weird like that. But. I, if I'm if I'm using a tiny cup, 
I reused the tea bag because I'm like I didn't I didn't get everything out of that that I wanted. I really love loose leaf teas though. I don't have any right now though. I guess Rose Mom is sending her some loose leaf tea, so I'll have to try that. Um, you can't really get it here very easily. I know that when we were in Europe, there were lots of like tea stores that just had like barrels and barrels of just loose leaf teas and it was so cool, but um, we don't really have those here. People don't drink tea as much here. So like you, you buy, you buy the boxes or like at, sometimes at farmer's markets, but you have to be in the right place. Um, cause not, it doesn't grow everywhere, you know? So, hmm. Indeed. The tea. Things to think about with tea. I know people who put, um, like milk in their tea. I never really thought to do that. Except like, um, Thai iced tea is like that, I guess. But... I don't think that it would taste as good without, like, actual milk, probably. I should try it anyway, though. <laughs> because who knows? Maybe it's delicious. Maybe, like, with, hmm, vanilla rice milk or something? That might taste good. Or just regular rice milk. I should just try that. Because rice milk has some of those more earthy flavors to it, too. So does soy milk. So milk is hard on your teeth, though. <coughs> yep. I think that's about all that I have to say about tea. <laughs> but yeah, coming back to what I originally said, I see I see people make videos of themselves like making tea all the time, like how a real British person makes tea, and then I giggle, <laughs> I'm like okay. Um, Maybe I should, maybe I should, maybe I should do a, how a real American makes coffee. <laughs> It'd be so boring. I would have to like put some like, whoosh, whoosh, sounds in there to make it even remotely cool. Done. It's happening. It's happening now. I'm excited about this idea. It's gonna happen. Oh. Yes. So. Guess I'm gonna go and continue to wait for them to show up and pick me up. But I hope that you guys have a good day, and I will talk to you again tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye.